Hi, I'm Sammy with Bar Under the Stairs, and today I'm going to show you the best Bloody Mary recipe I know. First things first, I like my Bloody Marys with a little kick to them, so I'm going to add a jalapeno into a jar, and I'm going to infuse the vodka in it. So I have that heat coming off the vodka before I even mix it. So I like to do that instead of Tabasco sauce. If you don't like the spicy stuff in your drink, just omit the uh, jalapeno thing. You can also use a habanero pepper. You can use a serrano. You can use anything, any pepper that's fresh that you want. It really doesn't take a whole lot of time to infuse either. So it's a pretty quick process. Just gonna cut pepper in half and de-seed. Alright, after that, whoo, just add those into a jar. <coughs> it's very spicy. And pour some vodka over it. I pretty much just eyeball this because you never know how hot or spicy a pepper is going to end up being. So really it's just kind of like a weight and taste. I'm going to let this sit here for about 20 minutes, tasting it every five minutes to make sure it's not too hot for me. And uh, when it's ready, we'll go ahead and start building this drink. All right, so I just tasted the vodka and I believe it is at the spice level that I desire. I'm going to go ahead and take out the jalapeno. Whoa! It's on the floor under the bar. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and take a shaker and I'm gonna start with the vodka. We are gonna do two ounces of this infused vodka. Spicy, spicy. All right, next up is going to be pickle juice. So, this sounds a little cuckoo, but honestly, it's fantastic. I'm just gonna take about an ounce of pickle juice, measure it out, and pour it on in. We always keep a giant jar of pickles here, so it's always very convenient. <laughs> we use this pickle juice up. We don't actually, it's not true. <laughs> but if we ever need pickle juice, we have it. All right. Next up is going to be a lemon juice as well as lime juice. We're going to do a half an ounce of each. And last but not least, we just need the Zing Zing. So the general consensus on Bloody Mary Mix is, why would you? A Zing Zing is awesome. It's great ingredients to use. It's, it's just exactly what you need. It's seasoned right. Why go through all the pain to make Bloody Mary Mix from scratch? So four ounces. 
yeah, it's really not better when you make it from scratch. In fact, it has a lot less flavor. All right, so I'm just gonna add some ice. Just a few cubes, you don't need that, that many. And I'm going to go ahead and give it a good shake. And that's about all. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a Tom Collins glass. Add some ice cubes. And go ahead and pour that on. All right. Don't give me sinuses and garnishes for garnish. I am not going to do anything crazy because, you know, I don't need a hamburger on top of my Bloody Mary. I just want Bloody Mary. I am going to cut up a couple wedges of lemon and lime. I'm going to take a toothpick if I can get one out. All right, and I'm just gonna go ahead and skewer on the lemon juice, or I'm gonna skewer on the lemon and the lime wedges and a little bit of the pickle here, maybe another lime wedge. There we go. <laughs> That's as crazy as it's gonna get around here. Or as Bloody Mary garnishes. I can't confess to anything else. But... That's all, folks. All right, let's give this a taste. Garnish to the side. Yeah. That is perfect. That is like the pickle juice, the lime juice, the lemon juice with the seasoned tomato juice and that spicy jalapeno vodka. It is perfect. So it's like a little kick and then just the right acidity, the right tartness, the right uh, savoriness. And you know, this is like the perfect Bloody Mary. I don't even know how to stress this enough. You've got to make this recipe. If you're making Bloody Marys any other way, I swear you're doing it wrong. This is my friend Tiffany's recipe and she showed me it when we were working on a Bloody Mary bar at the distillery and I've never gone back. This is the only Bloody Mary I want. Ah, oh, it is just perfect. It is perfect. Uh, yeah, I have nothing further to say. This is the best Bloody Mary recipe in the world. All right, this has been Sammy with Bar Under the Stairs. Please check out our other videos and uh, comment. Let us know how you like to do your hangover in the morning. And, uh, bye.